Good morning, folks. It has been a long night here. Today, we're going to keep it quick because you've got a news recap to catch from last night. Seriously, watch it. And website members, you've got our podcast coming up here soon. Otherwise, things are very, very quiet. A short bit of notes this morning so you have time to watch that dynamite you've missed. That active region is alone and silent. Well, alone if you don't count the coronal hole next to him out ahead. There have been no solar flares and so focuses on the solar wind due to arrive this weekend. Thus far, it is all calm as we did get to see that plasma filament we'd watched for days erupt away from the sun's southwestern limb. It will miss Earth. Volcano in Hawaii. Another day, another 5.3. Clockwork once again. Storm watch in the U.S. tonight as the remnants of Bud are heading at the Canadian low. Isolated storm cells expected, but also expected to be harsh. Other top weather outlook is in Japan, where a typhoon is going to skirt the southern portion of the country. This is a fairly standard track for these systems, but it is the first solid one that will affect land this year. Top weather of yesterday was in the Ukraine, where storms took out power to a few hundred thousand from south to north in the country and killed one. Two links for today. One is to this impression of Mars with water, and what they think it used to look like. Pretty fun to imagine. Now stop imagining things, because that's the problem here. Turns out the last couple times Earth had this much CO2 in the atmosphere, Antarctica did not melt. It is indeed imagination that lets scientists think our CO2 is melting that ice from the bottom on top of the world's largest submarine volcano discovered by Texas three years ago. If that topic hits a nerve, you definitely need to watch last night's recap. If not, I recommend you watch last night's recap anyway. Seriously. Quick hits this morning to get you on your way. It is time to prepare for the podcast and chat session, which will start at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time over at suspiciousobservers.org. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.